What's your name, man? Tamer Lov. Tamer Lov. No, Tamer Lov. Hey, nice to meet you, Tamer Lov. <laughs> Shalom. Thank you for the welcome today. And it's going to be an awesome meal. Very nice Salve. to meet you. Cool. You guys, this is it. The final day for the Georgia trip. Man, there is still such a list of places, such a list of things that I want to experience. But last night, I was having a conversation with my wife. And if you know Lee, you won't be surprised at what she said. She said, Joel, don't tell me that you are going to come home without one meal of a meat feast, some kind of barbecue. That is a cold country. You can't tell me that they don't eat some barbecue in that country. So those of you who are familiar with Azerbaijan, you will know just the ancient blend of cultures and also how that blend makes its way into the food, of course, but also the, the languages are diverse. Just the history of this area really is amazing. Hope you love the meal that we share together tonight at Nar Restaurant. I'm super stoked. Out here in the kind of courtyard, it's just so green. I love all the trees. Yeah, you can see Georgia is cool enough that things like evergreens, pine trees can grow, but also super cool. Georgia is also warm enough that they can get a lot of fruit, multiple species of figs. Oh yeah, and actually Nar restaurant. Nar actually means pomegranate in Azeri language. Anyways, I'm gonna leave the order up to my friend and I am gonna go with you inside and look at the interior of the restaurant. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, okay. Yeah? Yes, for sure. Yeah. 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 This room. I know, it's awesome. <laughs> what a setup. Feels like we're in somebody's living room in then, Baku. Oh, yeah. So we are all good friends here, and it is so cool. We're all being treated the, the VIP experience. Tim, welcome. Tim just got off an airplane. Long flight. This is the ideal way to be received off a 20 hour plane flight. And then our friends, uh, to the total Brad and Joy, right oh. here. Brad and Dora are the reason we're sitting in this room. They're yeah. the VIPs. Yeah, for sure. But it's got, you can see Let's the try this drink. Yeah, so you know it's not cheers. Right. Cheers. We don't even know what we're cheersing yet. Uh, it's a <laughs> uh, Wow. It's very sweet. I think that, you know, it's a sphere. Like, like you great. unfortunately have to go yeah. this, whereas like, like, like if you go east-west, you can licorice. just hop up, mm. like, depending on which way you're going, like, yes. just on yeah. the whole. Mini yeah. meat dumpling soup. Uh, oh man! I think it's like a raspberry. No burger. way! Yeah, yeah. So then the soup is served with some yogurt. Yogurt. But also, there is a raspberry vinegar. How cool! With the yeah, soup. Yeah. You want to try it before Just and pour. after the raspberry? Oh, sure. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. You want to pray? Pray first. All right. Uh, thank you for these people who serve and uh, labor here at this restaurant. I pray your blessing on them. Thank you for this food. Thank you for the opportunity to enjoy some of the culture of Azerbaijan through this cuisine. And we pray you just bless our time in your son's name. Amen. 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 You know, it's soft for now again. I mean, it's not like piping hot, but it's still. You've got the crispy kind of, outside too. Yeah. Opens yep. it back up again. Yep. Oh my this, gosh. This with honey or that. jam. Or this yeah, thing the is amazing. Is. The miniature, uh, uh, miniature dumplings. This thing is just incredible. No way. Yeah. Go over and get your bread. Come back. You don't have to because the hotel has clean broth. With food, you a little bit really fatty. I don't know if it's oregano or if it's thyme, but there's a awesome herb just sprinkled across the top of the soup. And then the soup itself is just exactly the thing that you want in the cold. Grab some warm bread, eat it together with the soup. But the, the craziness is these two additions. So I tried the soup already, amazing. The miniature dumplings, just so, just so cool. Okay, but let's try the super sides vinegar. And then is it sour cream or yogurt? Yeah. Uh, they don't usually bring oh, purpose. that is just amazing. Uh, Dushbara dish, dish. and then chorba would mm. be soup. It's Turkish. Turkish. Mm. Uh, that's they kind of like push through okay. that. And, uh, the soup is awesome on its own, but with that vinegar. Little, little 
totally unique. She's I, totally different. I can't even believe Aiden's, it, but I only poured it. She's, like she's actually been. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah, he's doing a good job too. Yes. yes. <laughs> good one. Yeah. And you know, Joy. Man. Yeah. You told me a lot about your restaurant. So yeah, thank yeah. you for welcoming us. <laughs> Very nice to meet you. Right, me too. Yeah. Again, amidst a lot of friendly talking and storytelling, another amazing dish has hit the table. Temelo, what is the name of this? Khinja. Uh, okay, I know the Saj is the highlight. It's probably going to be the show stealer, but for me, I've never seen this dish before. So when I just saw it on the menu, just have to have to order Khinja. Khinja. Dude, it just looks so unique. Mom, that is just great. Oh, there are noodles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, are you ready to try the noodles? Yeah, let's do it. 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 But it's lamb. Oh, oh boy. Mm -hmm. You can tell by the smell or the, the, the flavor. high fat. Oh, nice one. Yeah. It's very good. It's very fatty. And the onions are in there. There's some kind of fruit, maybe raisins. Oh, cut up or something. What a cool dish. Oh, this is interesting. Yeah. Hey, good description, Mom. Like it smells like licorice. Yeah, yeah. They, they, they crush hibiscus sometimes. Uh, yeah, star anise. Yeah, star anise. Mm. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Just perfectly <laughs> oily. The noodles just slide apart. It's so smooth, so soft, like mom's. Oh man! And the sweetness of those onions is is really impressive. That's amazing. Yeah, because uh, what we'd say is the north part of Iran is mm -hmm. all Aziri. Oh, oh right. Okay. So, so it's it's it's, uh, it's a fact, and safe it's to fact. say, really there's fun. more. Azerbaijani people in the north part of Iran than all of Azerbaijan. Ethnically. The country. Oh, true. Wow. Right. Right. Yeah. After that first compote, uh, I'm trying the, the lemonade. It's a pear lemonade. Also incredibly sweet, almost like cream soda. Mm -hmm. Love sweet. I remember the last time I've eaten rice with a fork. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm like, what is this? Yes. Yeah. So like my dad said, our friend Brad is the VIP. Brad loves this restaurant. He was very excited to bring us here, and I see why. Brad, can I just ask you, after a few visits, what was something that was like so surprising? Maybe you just never expected that flavor from Azerbaijan or Azeri food. Yeah. So Azerbaijani food would be uh, related to yeah. Turkish food, and it, had, it would have Mediterranean spices, uh, some Turkish, uh, more uh, the meats like lamb. Uh, so Georgia wouldn't do a lot with lamb. They do uh, chicken, ah. they do beef, they do um, pork. Okay. Of course, pork is not going to be uh, you know something you're going to have in Azerbaijan. Yeah. So yeah. a lot of lamb, um, uh, sheep meat, even goat meat. All of it's really tasty. They do. Uh, slow cook it. We're not in Azerbaijan, but we feel like we are in Azerbaijan yeah, when yeah, we come to this totally. restaurant. I mean, you, you just get lost into this other world with the food, the taste, the the, the, the people here that uh, have been here for years and years who are the, the servers. And uh, um, yeah, so yeah, we're in Georgia, but not right now. Yeah, we're in Azerbaijan right well now said. in well this said. restaurant. <laughs> Thanks, man. It's a better intro than what I could do. <laughs> Joel's not, Joel's not carrying his weight. He's playing with that camera uh, way too much. Nice. Uh, so he's <laughs> warm. Okay. <laughs> and they, would, they would normally do these, uh, this one here, you'd have uh, some rice and this kind of at the same time, or at least one follows the other really quickly. Oh, there you go. Telling another amazing dish has hit the table. These <laughs> kebabs, look at them. I only know from watching, you know, videos about Persian food. I love how they serve it on bread. You see that? So in Georgia, and this bread is called lavash. Like we moved into a new house, mm. and our teacher, our, our Greek teacher, gave us a pom like a, a ceramic pomegranate. Man. And she's like, "You're supposed to go outside and smash the pomegranate for good luck." Oh, I'm just doing the beautiful the, kebab. This meat, you don't want to swallow it with the uh, just the, the fat and the, the meat that comes together, and they form mm. it right. You just want to just keep it in your mouth the whole time. Yeah. Like just, <laughs> that is a line. <laughs> that is a line. Mm. Okay, so I want to dive in with my hands. Fork and spoon only go so far, and we are a multicultural blend at the table for sure. Okay, kebab, and then the saj that we're about to have. 
That is also an ancient recipe. This one just looks amazing, just dripping. Just pushing it like that, there's just, my thumb is getting nice and oily. This is just so awesome. <laughs> You're chewing too much. It's so soft. <laughs> the soft meat and the um, and the bread that's crusty. Mm -hmm. It's a good combination. <laughs> I was gonna say the noodles were my favorite, but no, that's mm -hmm. incredible. That meat, no, that uh, salt. No, the that onions. meat's like younger awesome. brother or sister. But like you say that for everybody who's younger than it makes it louder. Can you get everything? Mom, Wait, yeah. is Denise in there? Yeah. No, she is. No. Yeah. When he's ready. Yeah. Then mom's had the crispy bread. But simply as an afterthought that time. That the kebab is just, that's all you want. Mm. Mm. Oh, it's a Whoa! Oh, from the owner? Oh my gosh. Oh, dude. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Can you just put it in the bag? I mean, this, this was already awesome, and now the colorful parts of the cuisine have arrived. The, the barbecue is so awesome. This whole fresh side of the table. Tim, thanks, man. Is that a potato or no, an eggplant? it's not just a potato. Oh, oh. That's a piece of, yeah. yeah. It's a potato. It's not just a potato. <laughs> even, even, <laughs> even something mon as mundane as a potato, yeah. they just, they mm. it up. Better, yeah. yeah. they just, I mean, it's like, what? You try to do that at home and it's like, this comes out like... Yeah, mixed meat. You're right. Be, it uh, is cheap and... Uh, it is a potato, beef. but it is not just a potato. Do you put this on? Do you put... So this is Bajajani, this is eggplant oh, here. Oh. It's eggplant and that's potato. You know, even in Southeast Asia too long, I thought this was plantain. Oh, thought this was plantain. oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. But zucchini or eggplant. I like zucchini here. Yeah. And mom, there's your pepper. Potato. Super and good. That is so freaking good. This is Whoa. mixed meat. Oh my gosh. So Sorry, sheep. are we ruining your and, shot? Um, no, no. Do I need to Brad, this is... So this is sheep. Sorry, I'm making our own This is sage, which uh, actually uh, re represents oh, how it's no. cooked. And uh, oh, normally you would have charcoal that's or right. And then they would do that outdoors, indoors, whatever. But uh, they prepared mm -hmm. this uh, uh, in the kitchen. But that's where the name comes from. Uh, this is a uh, badrujani, which would be eggplant, and potato, kartoffel, um, and then you have uh, the, the the peppers and the tomatoes, the fresh herbs, the lemon. Lemon comes with everything in Azerbaijan. That's lemon awesome. with everything. But then the mi mixed meat is lamb, chicken, and beef all together, and just uh, again melt in your mouth kind of thing. It's so good. Yeah, I tried not to eat it all before you finish. Hey, you guys, this. I couldn't possibly yes, think of a better like it's final a, meal. A little bit gamier. So this is amazing. Like a little fatty, but it's still in your mouth. Uh, it looks like cherry tomatoes. I would, oh. Russian uh, mindal. English, I don't know. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. It's, that's it's, awesome. You'll find out when you put it in your yeah, mouth. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. That was perfect. So I love those. And the sashikari is the oh. main for gift. Straight to dessert. Oh. That's, uh, yeah, this is from the owner, which I'm supposed to eat dessert oh. first, right? Owners are actually yeah, you're, you're not so, wrong, Tim. Oh, they they're are. sitting right out there. Oh. I'll join you. They're crunchy. That is a strange texture. Does it hit you? Really? It hit you no, it's like dry, but it's soft. Hey. I just, hello, hello. That's Dude, a, it's it's soft, Brad, you are crunchy. There. Is that not the strangest thing? Has to be some kind of plum, <laughs> but it's just like not yet fully ripe. It's way too crunchy. And you're right, dry, even though it's in liquid. <laughs> wow. That is way wow. unique. Hmm. You're old, dude. <laughs> Time is moving. Man. So I'm into the sage. I see mushrooms, bones. It's like, dude, it's like, yeah, just the whole animal chopped up, all the pieces. This is amazing. So it's a mix. Brad said off lamb, chicken, eggplant, which is, what's that eggplant called? Oh, sorry. Badrajani in Badrajani, that's right. But, um, and... And Brad said lemon with everything for a zuri. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, one more of the super potatoes. <laughs> How about some parsley? And we're going back over here. I love the tablecloth too. It's like a tapestry being used for a tablecloth. It's yeah, amazing. it is. Okay, so I have my second helping over here. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. And my second so helpings heavy. over here. I'll get back to that. Is this the eggplant yeah. first. 
two signal numbers for her, and it's both her pictures. Like, it's not some street. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing can contain she smokiness like that from the charcoal, from the grill, like an eggplant. Like, 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 Mm. An incredible combo. Oh, you know what? The, the tomatoes are added afterwards. Everything is grilled in the middle. But then the potatoes mm. are fried. Oh, yeah, the tomatoes are. And the tomatoes are like fresh, right? Yeah. And yeah. this part of the world has incredible tomatoes. Wow. It's, really, it's incredible. It's really I'm gonna there. get on the plane. A very happy man. Yeah. Starting the second round, I think I'll finish off the kebab. Man, I can just imagine we're out there sitting next to the sea, maybe on a sand dune mm -hmm. with a bonfire, and that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's sure. Yeah. Just no, good shit. Yeah. Oh, what? So what is that, Brett? Mm -hmm. oh, the kid brought it, and it was our, I think it was What our is thing. that? No, I mean at the Some end. Some of At the end. <laughs> Wow. Yeah. Brad, you're right. Mm -hmm. Gotta get the proportions right. Man, that is amazing. Uh, Thank you. I saved them right I only recognize the size of the teacup from <laughs> Turkey, but obviously this is a tradition in Azerbaijan as well. Even the sugar, so these are sugar cubes that are Whoa. exactly portioned out to one. Mm. So if you ask for one or two, it's not like a random yeah. spoon, you know, mm. proportion. Hey, that's super cool. And uh, he knows this, but uh, like his father, his uncle, or his grandfather, the older guys, they'll put a sugar cube right oh, here. Oh, okay. Put tea straight through it and oh. dissolves, and you know, oh, that's the cool. dentists love it. Yeah. Oh, like a, like a train wreck. Right? You just can't look away. You gotta watch it for What's he up to? Maybe I picked too large of a tea cube. He joined a, a group, yeah. and okay. he really hard to do. Oh. We have lost track of them. You met him. Mm. Yeah, but barely. I mean, he, when he spoke, he was talking like about cardamom. Was, was yeah. Maybe fennel. Yeah. Yeah. This is amazing. What do you think is that is not just black tea. No, uh, it's cardamom. It's delicious. Cardamom, but, but yeah, it's more. Yeah, they don't really do nice. as much cardamom as it's 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 going to taste. It's so smooth too. Chad. The reason it's mm -hmm. smooth is because oh, they let really? that steep mm -hmm. mm -hmm. for the exact amount of time. Not an easy time. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. That, that yeah. really is an art. Yeah. It's, like, yeah, and especially like a host, like to be able to do that just exactly right, that, uh, that is what you need to finish the I meal. Right? Like, so there is a lot of bergamot, like it's a, it's, uh, yeah, it's like actually, there's two, like it's, he will be the second person from the chapel in the Baton that is going to More the chat. There's another girl that, sure. she married oh, a guy okay. from Regis as well. And uh, or a lemon sliced, <laughs> oh, mostly okay. lemon sliced, and the tea. Uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Oh. Okay, now I understand why. So we need this. <laughs> no, so we don't, you don't have to do it. Yeah, Sometimes, yeah. you know, I'm straight. impressed. Yeah, the tea it's is it's so straight. flavorful, so smooth. Did you, did you this is some? this is like already good. Yeah. Like with the, the other flavors. Is it, it, oh, it's under it. Is it a win? <laughs> <laughs> you got 24 hours to live. <laughs> What's gonna be worse than that? I should have told you yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> he okay. You know what? He was putting his hand over the top to check that it was on the whatever he did. Maybe there's oh, uh, no, no, you're okay. wow, uh, some right. kind of coal that he put down in there, or? Mm, oh man, that fruit platter is amazing. Uh, they are really taking care of us tonight. Mm -hmm. Now our restaurant team, thank you. Thank you so much. 
Chocolate sour. Sour. Yeah. Dude, that is incredible. Dad, you are missing out. Look at that. He is, but he's not here. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Yeah. I almost thought I was going to lose it there. It was so thick. I thought, did I make a mistake trying to hold it and cut it? So. Obviously, he's he's more down, yeah, in the east. This is his first time here. So she goes up to talk to Joy at the international church that we attend. Mm -hmm. And the, the lady who's come out oh. to talk to Joy oh. Oh. recognizes her from one of his YouTube videos. Stop our he started, conversation. He started, like, um, doing stuff about Georgia, so she picked up somehow. It came over. Oh, my gosh. You guys... My new friend, well, I've made a lot of new friends this evening actually. The, the support team here are just so friendly. It's so cool. Um, and the way that my friend Brad just presented the whole cuisine basically. I've never had food like this. Maybe similar, maybe even shared influences, but I've never had a meal like this. And what a way to be introduced to this amazing cuisine. Actually, my dad has traveled to Azerbaijan several times. Obviously, my friend Brad, and he has friends right here, right here in Tbilisi. And there's a huge community, actually, of Azeris right here in Tbilisi. It's just... Important. And also, because this is my final meal in Georgia, this is the last night. Actually, I'm going to the airport in about four hours. Uh, Georgia, the welcome that you have given me has been just incredible. Cannot wait to visit again. And for now, Shemo Gevlos, Shemitavi, Sasio Molnoa, Troibi, Didi Marloba.